goodness. What are you doing? Hi. 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 How, how are you today? I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm good. How was your weekend? What did you do this weekend? I go to school, learn, mm. learn exercise. Oh my gosh. Okay, so you have to show me the moves. What moves did you do? That's so nice. It feels amazing on your back. <laughs> and what else? Oh, uh... knee stuff. Yes, what do you do but... with your knees? Oh my word. <laughs> a squat. You call that a you call that a squat in English. Oh uh, yeah, that's quite difficult. I, I squats are quite hard to do. And did you I remember once you were doing things with your wrist. Mm -hmm. And you're also doing that neck stuff. Yeah. Oh, uh, it feels nice. Oh, it actually hurts. My neck is so stiff. Okay, cool. And what did you do today? Did you read any cool books? Yeah, I read no. Quinn. Quinn, and what 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 happened in the series today? Sorry, I just need to close all these tabs. There's so many open. It's long. Long? Very, very, <laughs> okay. very long. Was it good though? Was it a good story? Yeah. Nice. Okay, teacher. What is that? Stop share. What is it? Like Play-Doh? Yeah. Oh, cute. Like slime? No slime. Oh, oh that's amazing. That's such a cool like sensory thing to play with. Wow, love it. So how long have you been playing with that for? Long time. Well, let's see, a 495 page seven. And what's your baby brother doing today? He's go to school and learn with oh. me. Oh, oh, you guys aren't in the same class though, hey? Yeah. Not in the same class? Yeah. How much younger is he? He's six. He's right? going to one and I go to three. Oh, okay. So there's a two year age gap. Okay. So do you see him at school? Does he have lots of friends? Yeah, he got a friend. And his friend give me is. Oh, I see. Oh, cool. And where's mom today? Is she at work today? No, she um he she's at home. Oh, uh, when does she go back on shift? In Friday. No, no, oh no, goodness. in Wednesday. In Wednesday. On on Wednesday. And then how long has she gone for? Hmm, I don't know. Oh, uh, okay. And what does she do when she's at home? Eat the cake. Oh, uh, cool. What does mom do? Is she tired when she's at home from working those shifts? Yeah, she sleep. Oh, shame. <laughs> so she's sleeping at the moment? Because she don't sleep in the uh, Monday and Tuesday. So she has to catch up he on was, all sleep. She was. He, she don't sleep. Oh, my goodness. Shame, man. So she's sleeping right now? Yeah. She oh, very... wow. <sighs> <sighs> when does she When does she come out of her room? In the... Uh, Six o'clock. Oh, and then who makes dinner? My uh, my grandmother. Oh, cool. Okay, nice. And my what do you grandmother think cook very much. Oh, what is your favorite meal that she cooks? Chicken. Yummy uh, chicken. Like what kind of chicken? Like chicken and rice or what? Yeah, chicken and rice. Chicken and rice. Cool. Okay, so we're going to carry on reading over here. Uh, let's go. I just want to close the door, Quinan. I'm sorry. It's it really is cool. a dining, they are di dining family. Who? Dining family. 
Who is a dining family? Oh, you guys. No. Oh, cool. Dining family. Dining? Like yeah. you like to eat? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, for sure. Okay, I just need to close the door. One second. Oh, my. <laughs> I'm sorry, Quinan. It was very cold. Where you go? I had to close the door. It's freezing, and the door is open, so I had to go close it. Okay. Are in you Vietnam ready? Vietnam to... is very rainy, very very big. Is it hot or rainy? Rainy. Oh, rainy, the rain. Rainy, the... Very big. The lots of rain, lots of rain. Yeah. How long has it? How long has it been raining for? In breast, I eat breakfast this. Since breakfast? Yeah. Yeah, it's also very cold. Yeah, I'll show you quickly. I don't know if you can see. It's no, very bright. No, no, no. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Is that outside? Where is that? Yeah, outside. Oh, <laughs> I want to see. Can you move your laptop? No. Yeah, it's very, very <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, this is ours. I'll show you. Oh, no, no, wait. I don't know what I'm doing. Hold on. I'm blurred oh, instead of... Is. Yeah, here's ours. It's not raining, but you can see it's like windy and horrible. Oh. Can you see? Like it's cold. The The sky Very is cold. white. But my grandma yeah, this... like it. My grandma grand... like cold. Really? Why? Yeah. Because hearts make him, make her very, very oh, tired. Yeah, the heat can make you a bit tired. But I feel like the cold can sometimes make you sad. Do you know what I mean? Sometimes cold weather makes me feel a little bit like, I don't know why. Okay, let's go. We're going to carry on reading about superpowers. So one more text. <laughs> one more text about somebody's idea on superpowers. What does that say over there? In my view, being able to fly would pass a security... Security threat? Security threat of both national and international level border mm -hmm. pro pro protection work become a major content mm -hmm. and countries work constantly need to patrol their aspect. It would be more difficult to protect individual properties to which could in increase increase the risk of Bulgari mm -hmm. and personal safety, air safety, and traffic control would mm -hmm. be inevitable in towns and cities to bring some other to the bring some other uh, order to the skies order yes, sorry about to that. the sky uh -huh. with regard to regard. immortality there uh -huh. is no question it will deplete the planet of mm. its resources yeah. And the prospects of living living in increasingly over 
Overcrowded. Overcrowded, yeah. Conditions is far from appealing for most. My superpower of choice would be a ability to move at superhuman speed with the necessary face and heat protection to keep us intact. Tardy arrivals would be a thing of the past. Well done. Perfect. You read beautifully. Okay, cool. So we're going to match over here. Um, let's go take a look at we're going to match words to their definitions. So let's start with number one, to envisage. Envisage, sorry, envisage. To envisage, what is your, so say envisage. To envisage, what does it mean to envisage something? Out of those, to fall a long way, A, to reach a great height, B, C, to have a mental picture of something, to imagine, D, to set a light or start burning, to have an idea, belief, persistently in mind, to prevent something from causing a problem, um, to harbor, and last one, to keep something at bay. So let's start with envisage. What does it mean to envisage something? To envisage. Hmm. What do you think? To have an idea, beloved, to persistently in mind. To have a mental picture of something. Uh, to have an idea. No, 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 no. Not that one. Try again. To have a mental picture of something to imagine. Very good. Yes. To have a mental picture of something to imagine. What does it mean to ignite something? To, 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 um, to reach a great hit. No. So ignite, think of fire. Like, too far a long way. No. <coughs> Try again. So, ignite. you have an idea, beloved, to persistently make. No. <laughs> so think of fire. Think of fire. Think of fire. So to ignite, I'll show you, is to set a light or start burning. Like <laughs> silly belly. Okay, to patrol. What about to patrol? Patrol, patrol, patrol. What does it mean to patrol? No. So like security guards would patrol an area to make sure there are no bad people there. No. I can't hear you. 
are you talking? No, are you? So to patrol means to check an area for trouble. To check. So let me go to Google Translate. Maybe that. Oh, I see. Be. What? I saw it. <laughs> what do you say? I did you. Oh, I'm so sorry. Patrol, patrol, patrol. Pancha. 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 <laughs> okay. Oopsie. Let me close that one. Now to deplete. Deplete. Let me go write deplete in here. Deplete. Oopsie. Wrong word. Chitbin. Chitbin. What does it mean to deplete? Chitbin. Something from causing a problem. Mm -mm. No. Yes. No. <laughs> yes. Not yes. Yes, no. no. Yes, no. Not that one. Yeah. No. Try again. Too far, a long way. No. Ah, I know. To beat a great hand. No. Oh, to this is. <laughs> Chipping. Chipping. What? Out the army? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Made that word. Okay, no, it's uh, it's to reduce in size or amount. So if something is depleted, it gets smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller, and then eventually it doesn't. That's depleting. What about store? Soaring. You right, soar over here. Uh, By land. English. Okay. So. By land. So. By land. By land. By land. Okay. Which one is it? Which one is it? To so. so. To reach a great head. Mm-hmm. To reach a great height, you are amazing. <laughs> well done. Woo oh, excellent. Well done. Okay, cool. To plunge. Plunge. Okay. He plunged okay. to his death. Plunge. Mm -hmm. To prevent something from causing a problem. No, try again. He fell a long way. Yes, he plunged to his death. He fell to a long way. Excellent. Well done. Okay, next one, we've got the to harbor something. To harbor an idea or belief, etc. To prevent something from causing a problem. No. Uh, mm -mm. uh, uh <gasps> to have an idea beloved. Yes. ETC passes tensely in mind. Yes, there we go. Amazing. E good. Okay, cool. To keep something at bay. What does it mean to keep something at bay? To bear and prevent something from calling a Sing problem. A problem. <laughs> Very good. To prevent something from causing. Very good. Well done. You did amazing. Okay. Now, what is going on over here? We tried to do such it up. No, don't worry about that. Ugh, don't worry about that. I can't remember all the responses. Okay, so now you're going to make some passive sentences. So, for instance, people produce cars in this factory. There you would say, cars are cars? 
of five people in this factory. That is the example of the passive sentence. Passive. Yeah, that's how it looks. Number two. Chụp lại hả bà? Farmer, the farmer grows carrots in the field. How would you make that kind of passive sentence? Mm, a carrot. Carrots. Carrots. Yeah. Are, are, are grown. People. Farmers. Farmer. Farmer. Wait, by a farmer. A farmer. Sorry, I didn't see farmer. Farmer in. Farmer in this farm. In his fields. There we go. Okay, so. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Carrots are grown by a farmer in his field. Good. Next one. Mr. Mrs. Lawrence is milking her cow. Milking us. No, let's start with the cow. Cow milk. Milking is is being milked. Is being milked by who? By Mr. Large Ranch. Mrs. Lawrence, very good. Excellent. The cow is being milked by Mrs. Lawrence. Good job. Number four, Alexander is practicing golf these weeks. Hmm. Alexander is practicing golf these weeks. Golf? Golf. As Brodex. Is being practiced. Is being practiced. By Alexander. These weeks. These weeks isn't a great way to say it, but anyways. All right. Very, very good. Next one. Macy takes a lot of nature photo at weekends. Photos? Mm, I would say a lot of nature photos. I would say that. A lot of nature photos is are are uh, I don't know are being taken yeah. are being taken by by Missy at the weekend at the weekend perfect next one everyone in this class loves and respects Diana Class love. I would say Diana oh. is loved and respected. Diana is loved and respected. What would you say next? Mm. Diana. So Diana is loved and respected by everyone, everyone in, this in class. In class. Very good. Diana is loved and respected by everyone in this class. All right, cool. Next one. Uh, Mason and Lucas are reading bedtime stories. 
Red. Oh. Stories. Bedtime stories. Yeah. Bedtime story. Is. Yeah. Are. Are. Read. Are read. By my son to... and Lucas. Oh, uh, yeah, you're right. I read by. Well done. I made the mistake. Mason. And Luke. All right, good. The Hamilton, the Hamiltons are cooking roast turkey. Hmm. The Hamilton or cookie roast chicken, roast, roast turkey, roast turkey, are is is cooking being cooked being cooked by Hamilton by the Hamiltons. Good, well done. Excellent. Let's do another one. A mechanic is repairing your car in his garage. The cars? Your car? Your cars is yeah. repairing. Be being repaired? Repair by a mechanic in his by garage. a mechanic in his garage. Your car is being repaired by a mechanic in his garage. Okay, Quinn, we're gonna end off there. You did amazing. So proud of you. Thank you for your hard work. I'll see you soon. Bye, Quinn. Have Goodbye, a good evening. Teacher. Bye. Thank you.